हेलो एवरीवन होप यू ऑल आर फाइन एंड आई एम श्योर योर यूनिट टेस्ट वाज वेरी गुड टुडे वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग द आंसर्स ऑफ द क्वेश्चन पेपर एंड आल्सो आई होप यू ऑल हैव सीन द न्यू सिलेबस गिवन बाय द काउंसिल इट्स देयर इन द काउंसिल वेबसाइट इफ यू ऑल हैव नॉट चेक इट डू चेक दैट some chapters are deleted uh, what we had previously now we have a lesser number of chapters unfortunately we get so much of time for elements compounds and mixture and uh, now that chapter is no more in the portion so uh, that chapter we will not be revising any more you all no need to uh, read any more that particular chapter whatever you have done uh, your knowledge is there for separation and all if required in any other chapter you will be able to solve those separation based question we were doing atomic structure chapter so we will be continuing that chapter next day today uh, let us discuss the answers of the unit test question paper that's our unit test answers the first answer is happiness which is not a matter second question was gas to liquid state that is condensation third question was about uh, candle burning of candle as we know burning of candle their physical and chemical change both occur simultaneously so it will be both of this this is the option then intermolecular space increases i think it was a boiling and third is the rusting uh, is actually the oxide of iron question number 2 those are uh, fill in the blanks first is mass then liquid then periodic change then uh, chemical change occurs when there is reaction so answer is reaction and here negligible do not write no the question was the intermolecular space uh, in uh, solid is dash uh, so intermolecular space in solid is there but it is negligible so do not write that not there it is negligible next is for true false the first question was the uh, basic unit of helium is molecule we have already done helium or all the noble gases they are made up of atoms so false then true false false and false these are the answers so each question of these all carry one mark next you need to check or you need to select whether these changes are physical change or chemical change digestion of food digestion of food is of course a chemical change it's a permanent change as well so it's chemical change cutting of paper there is always remain a confusion but cutting of pa paper is a physical change the reason behind that is uh, after cutting the paper into small pieces the properties of the paper remain unchanged that means the small pieces and the paper itself is having uh, or will be having the same properties so though it is a non reversible irreversible change then also it is a physical change third is burning of wood burning is it actually itself is a chemical change dissolution of sugar this is about solubility of sugar you are adding sugar to water we are getting solution of sugar and after evaporation we are getting back the sugar again so it's a uh, easy uh, easily getting back we are getting back the starting material so it's of course a physical change and water cycle we know that water cycle is a physical change because it's a continuous process water cycle means from water then to vapor and then evaporation is occurring condensation is occurring again and again precipitation in forms of rain hail stones snows and we are getting back the water again so it's a continuous process it's continuously reversing and uh, there is no new product is formed because through the water cycle the different forms of water is uh, seen starting from the vapor uh, sometimes snow in form of ice water condensed uh, form of uh, vapor that is water droplets in cloud so all are having the formula h2o so no change in chemical composition so it's also a ex uh, example of it's an example of physical change so it's an physical change it is also an physical change here also it's an physical change these two are chemical changes So that's about the unit test question answers. So twenty marks, I hope maximum of you are going to get that, uh, and these chapters will be there in your half yearly as well. Anyways, take care. Next day we will be continuing with the atomic structure chapter, and bye.